Well, there's a new travel advisory from the State Department this week. It's warning against going to 80% of countries worldwide. But this morning, ABC 10's Monica Coleman is looking into research that shows flying may be safer than you think. Monica? Bria, the New York Times published an in-depth study about how viral particles can spread while you're traveling on plane. When you're on an airplane, the air is refreshed every three minutes, more so than when you're at the grocery store. But take a look at what happens when someone sneezes on board. So the person next to you on your flight just sneezed while wearing a mask. Now look at how the particles now move to the aisle as air blows from the sides, combining with air from the opposite row. If a passenger nearby takes off their mask even for a minute to eat a snack, it increases their chance of inhaling it, which could contain those viral particles. Now you are seeing what can happen if people sneeze on different parts of the plane. It stays contained to just a few rows. Throughout the flight, cabin air is sucked through two HEPA filters into a pipe under the floor, where fresh and recirculated air are mixed. Each filter has 12 panels of densely pleated fiberglass mesh that catch most microscopic particles. Airflow is not the only risk that comes with traveling by plane. You also have to consider the time spent at your terminal, sitting at the airport restaurant, and going through security. All moments where you could be infected, even if you are fully vaccinated. Bria. Monica, thanks. A pretty cool example there. And